Hi, I'm Cloud Lecture 99, and this is Cards and Talk. For the card of the week this week, it will be by Brendan Davis Otto. One of my favorite cards in my collection, as he was the first professional athlete that came on this podcast and let me interview him. I've now interviewed four professional athletes, and all one, all of them have been such an amazing experience, and I hope to interview very many more. But I'm really fond of this autograph card, one of my favorites, and I got it for a good price, in my opinion, and just one of my favorite cards in my collection. Now, let's get into the top part of the talk. Football season is back, so we will be talking about football. And so, in the American, in the NFC, in the AFC East, you have the Patriots and Mills at 2 0, and Jets and Dolphins at 0 2. You have the AFC North, Ravens 2 0, Browns 1 1, Cincinnati and Pittsburgh. Both 0 and 2. And then you have AFC South with Colts, Texans, Titans all at 1 and 1, and Jacksonville at 0 and 2. And then in the AFC South, you have. The Kansas City Chiefs 2-0, Oakland Raiders and Los Angeles Chargers 1-1, and Denver Broncos 0-2. And and the NFC East, you have the Cowboys 2-0, Eagles 1-1, Redskins and Giants 0-2. And the NFC North has Green Bay 2-0, Detroit 1-0, Minnesota 1-1, and Bears 1-1. The Bears have been horrible as of late. Oh, my bad. The Lions are 1 0 and 1. Not 1 0. My bad. The Bears should have been able to beat the Packers, but our offense has been doing horrible. And our NFC South, you have the Buccaneers, Falcons, Saints 1 1, while the Panthers are 0 and 2. NFC West, you have 49ers, Seattle Seahawks, Los Angeles Rams 2 0, and Cardinals 0 1 and 1. And then let's look at some stats. The lead leader in passing yards, Pat Mahomes with 821. Andy Dalton, 729. Dak Prescott, 674. Kylo Murray, 657. And Matthew Stafford at 630. Then in rushing yards, you have Delvin Cook, 265. Saquon Barkley, 227. Marlon Mack, 225. Josh Jacobs, 184. Carlos Hyde, 173. <coughs> In receiving yards, you have John Ross at 270. Sammy Waltons at 247. Marcus Brown at 233. Odell Beckham at 232. And Michael Gullop at 226. Then in interceptions, you have Jamie Collins at 2, Anthony Harris at 2, Devin McBurney 2, Logan Ryan 2, and Desmond Trafant 2. In sacks, you have Miles Dorrit at 5, Zach Robert at 4, Bryson Murrow at 3.5, and Trey Hendricks, Hendrickson and Devin Tennant at 3. And then in tackles, you have Thomas Davis and Luke Keichel at 26. Jordan Hits at 25, Troy Lillian at 22, and Joe Chabot at 21. In the MLB stages, in the AL Central, Twins are top 93-59 record, Cleveland 89-63, White Sox 66-86, Kansas City 56-97, and Detroit 45 106. Then the Yankees 99 54, 
as the Tampa Bay Rays, Boston's 80 and 72, Toronto 61 91, Baltimore 49 and 103. In the AOS, the Astros have 153, Oakland 92 61, Texas Rangers at 74 79, Angels at 69 83, Seattle 65 88. And in the National League, you have St. Louis, 85-67, Milwaukee, 83-70, Chicago Cubs, 82-70, Cincinnati, 72-81, and then Pittsburgh, 65-88. And then in the East, you have Atlanta, 94-60, Washington's at 83-68, Mets, 79-73, Philadelphia, 78-73, Miami fifty three ninety nine, Dodgers are at ninety eight fifty five, Arizona seventy eight seventy five, San Francisco seventy four seventy nine, San Diego sixty nine eighty four, and Colorado sixty six eighty seven. Now wild card in the AL, you have Oakland at top plus two games, Tampa Bay, and second plus point five games with. Cleveland down by five games, so the only three in contention. Boston comes in fourth, but down by nine point five games. Probably not gonna make it, but they might make a push. In the NL, you have Washington plus one games, Milwaukee plus five games. Cubs are out by five. Mets are out by three and a half. No, oh, Cubs are out by point five, not five. My bad. Philadelphia is out by four. Arizona's out by five, and San Francisco might be able to make a push for those nine games. My opinion is it's going to be Mets and Washington in the wild card. Cubs are going to find a way to win the division. And then all the other, and then Atlanta and Dodgers are going to win their division. And then New York, Minnesota, Houston will all win their division. And Oakland and Tampa Bay. If that order will be the wild card, that is my opinion for this week. <coughs> and so then, um, and so now we'll look at the stats. American League Bound average has two. Anderson, 335. Jesus LeMahieu, 329. Black Whitley, 318. Contra Alberto, 314. John McCarter, 312. In the AL home runs, you have Trout, 45, Jorge Slow, 45. Such a shame to see Trout go down as he was having the great, a great year and really was going to win MVP. He still might. Michael Justine is still Trout, but it's such a shame to see him go down. At 3, you have Gleyber Torres at 38, Cruz and Brennan at 37 for fourth place. AL RBIs, you have Jose Ryu at 119, Rafael Lovers at 110, Alexander Bogarts and Jorge Solar at 109, Alex Bowman at 105. And then in AL wins, you have Volander at 19, Garrett Cole at 18, and Domingo Drummond also at 18, Edward Rogers 17, Marco Gonzalez 16. I think Marco is a great young pitcher and can really be something. Had a really great start to the year, but then had a bad month, and then was just solid for the rest of the year. But nothing special from him ever since his bad month. Definitely think he's going to improve and be a really good pitcher for Seattle. AL ERA has Bowling at 250, Derek Cole 261, Charlie Moran 316, Shane Bieber 326, Mike Minor 3.33. AL Sage, you have Aurelis Chapman. At 37, Robert Osuna at 35, Brad Hand at 34, Ian Kinney at 30, Alex Tom at 28, AL wins above replacement, Shout 8.3, Brendan 7.6, Marcus Seaman 7.4, Ricky Betts 6.6, 6, and Matt Chapman 6.3. In the NL, Brad Yavage of Rendon at 3.30, Christian Yelch at 3.29, such a shame that he also got injured. Tom Marte also has 329. Mitch Neal and Blattman are at 318 apiece. NL home runs, you have the um, home run leader in all in baseball. Rookie of the year candidate, Pino Alonso with 49. Eric Soros at 48. Tony Bellinger at 45. Christian Yelich, 44. Nolan Arado, 
Ferrari, and then RBI is Jack Freeman 119, Rendon 119, Arenado 117, Josh Bell 116, and Lord Esteban 115. And on wins, you have Strasbourg at 17, Dakota Hudson 16, Max Freed 16, Luis Castillo 15, Clayton Kershaw 14. ERA is Hindren Un 2.35, Mike Sorker 2.57. Charles Drum 2.61, Sonny Gray 2.80, Matt Rizzo 2.81, and our saves you have Kobe Yates 41, Will Smith 33, Merger Estelos also has 33, same with Josh Hamill 33, but Ken Trenton's coming in at 30, and then you have Cody Bellinger 8.5, Christian Yelts 7.1, Katon Marte 6.9, Anthony Rendon 6.5, and Trevor Story 6.1. Well, Thank you for listening to Cards and Talk. Hope you enjoyed it, and I will see you next week.